What's going on guys, Bobby here, and before I get into the games and start talking about what's going to be happening in this video, I just wanted to give you guys a little bit of attention on something that I've been working on. So I recently made an Instagram, I've had a Twitter for a while, and I've also recently made a Discord server. Now basically, what I'm trying to do is kind of just grow my own image so I can start to up my content, I can get better audio stuff such as a microphone, I can get a better face cam. I have one right now, it's good, but I want a better one so I can record better. And I want to start turning YouTube into something seriously full time which I can invest money in and get a lot of good product and really get some good content out for you guys. And a big way to do that is by having a strong social media following. So if you guys wouldn't mind, if you guys can please click on the link in the description below which follows my Instagram as well as my Twitter. The links are going to be down there for both of those as well as join my Discord server. That would be really huge and it would mean the world. You guys don't even have to do anything, don't like anything, just slap that follow and that would be awesome. So with that being said, we're going to be going into some Siege nuts and bolts over here and we're going to be playing frank now frank is super epic in this map i showed you guys a comp with frank but i never really played frank for you guys on this map so i really wanted to show you guys how easy and how ridiculous frank is so that being said let's get into the first game let's cut the chit chat let's just get right into it so here we go into the first game we're gonna be facing pika johnny boy and flex now if you guys don't know pika and johnny boy they are insane one tricks and what a one trick is is basically when you pick one brawler you like it a lot, and you just play that brawler so much, you become an absolute god at it. So Johnny has gotten 1,000 Colts numerous times, as well as Pika has gotten 1,000 Bull before. So he's going to break some walls. I don't really know why I did that, to be honest. It's definitely good against the Primo and the Bull, but not on a lane against Johnny. Hopefully I can get close enough where I can kill him. All right, I was able to do so. Probably should have opened the walls on the other side. To be honest, I should be taking the Primo. Just because I do have the range on him. We're going to stay alive here. Thus, we're going to be getting the first push. Let's see if we can attract this Primo. Come on, buddy. All right, the Primo. Oh, he does want to follow us. Okay. I guess he's just going to jump on, on our teammate. I don't know if that was the best decision, but whatever. Anyways, Foxtrot is definitely going to go down as he's getting hard pinched by Johnny and Pika. We definitely don't want to stay near Pika, so we're going to start moving this way. We do want our super, though, so we got to hit him one time. There we go, we got that one hit on him. They've done a lot of damage already, so we're just gonna come in and hit it a couple times. We know we're gonna go down though. I don't know if that was really the best decision, but to be honest, we didn't have a play right there. We were low health, so we're probably gonna die anyway, so I just got that one hit off on the Ike. The Primo is gonna get that power up. Let's see if we can get close enough to the Primo. All right, I was gonna try and get both of them, but Pico was just gonna, he was just, had, he had other plans basically, so we're gonna move away. Johnny's gonna try and get that super. We're gonna be able to juke out of the way. We're gonna miss our super on Johnny. We're just gonna try and bully him with our health to be able to get this uh, this power up, the siege bot, whatever you wanna call it. I mean, the bolt. I don't, I don't know why I always call it other things. I really gotta get used to the name bolt. I don't know why I'm not used to it already. Anyways, it's 5-5. Five, five. Is it gonna end in a tie? It will, so there's gonna be no siege bot for this time. Both comps seem to be really good on offense. Miss super over there, that wasn't really too good. Oh, we still picked up the bolt though. Hopefully we don't get clipped by Johnny. Well, Foxtrot decided he wanted to get clipped by Johnny, so I guess he took one for the team, you know. We, we didn't really get hurt by him because he was focusing on Johnny. I mean, he was focusing on Fox, but yeah, Johnny's an insane Colt. Like, I've seen him, the cra some of the craziest clips I've ever seen in this game were done by Johnny's Colt. Like, Johnny's an absolute beast. Anyways, it looks like they're going to be getting the next bot over here, unless we pull up some really crazy stuff within the next few seconds. They're up 7 with 30 seconds left, so it's going to be super hard for us to get this next bot. I mean, it looks like Johnny's going to be trapped by me and the lake, so we'll be able to get him probably. A oh, really good play by that Primo. I'm not aware that he has his super when he's close to it. So he punched me a few times without me knowing he's close to his super and was able to get the kill on me. Anyways, although they're able to get, they're going to be getting this bot, it's not the end of the world because we're likely going to get the last one. So as long as we don't let them do too much damage to us over here, it looks like we're in a good good position. Anyways, Foxtrot should be able to get that kill on Pika. He's going to do so, but he did trade. We only did lose by one bolt. I thought we were going to lose by more. Anyways, Colt does a lot of damage, so I'm hoping that Foxtrot can take out the Colt, although it looks like he went the other way. He went for the Primo. That's not something I would do, to be honest, but whatever. We're going to move back. Oh, we're going to die. All right, Foxtrot better do a lot of defensive damage over here. This isn't looking too good for us. All right. Oh, he got a super. It's over. It's so... I don't even know why I tried to body block that. Amazing game by them. That was a fun game. Um, didn't Definitely didn't play too well with the Frank there. They do kind of counter us in a weird way. Like, you don't, you don't really see these three brawlers on this map too much, but they all counter Frank. So it was super tough. GG's to them. They're amazing players. And with that being said, let's hop into the second game and hopefully we can show you guys some real domination.
So here we go into the second game. We're gonna be facing Sword, MTL Gang, and a Barley. I don't even know who the Barley is. And to be honest, I don't know who the Crow is. But yeah, Sword is a epic gamer. He's a really good player. You guys have seen me face him a couple times. I think I faced him last video, actually. And he is super, super good. He's one of our friends. We play with him a ton. Anyways, we're going to see what we can do. It's a current one-to-one -one tie. We're going to go down as the Leon does counter us. And I think their third does too, does it? No, no, no. We're only being countered by a Leon, so we might just try and avoid the Leon throughout the duration of this game. We're going to be able to get the super over there onto that crow. I have a feeling that the Leon is sneak right now, though. A very strong suspicion. Yep, there he is. Sneaky little Leon. We are probably going to go down to him, yeah, but we are going to get a level 4 seed robot, and getting that first bot is huge. So we're going to move up. Hopefully we're going to do a good amount of damage. A good amount of damage for the first push. Like, if you're doing 50%, that's that's amazing. That's really good. Anyways, Usain's going to go down over there. We're going to be able to take out Sword. Hopefully we can go up and use our super without dying. Yeah, I don't even know about that one over there. That, that was pretty bad. That was pretty brutal. But anyways, we're going to move up. You know, I do enjoy me when I show you when I can show you guys me messing up because I I feel like it makes you guys better players too when when I'm messing up, so you guys can see what not to do basically. It's a pretty OP strat. I should just make like a compilation of me messing up and just make that a video. But anyways, we're gonna go over there. We're gonna be down three to one. Yeah, it's three to one right now. Looks like they're gonna need another one. Foxtrot was able to get two kills over there, so good thing by good uh, play by Foxtrot. I don't know why I say good thing. It looks like we're going to be able to tie it. Actually, actually, if we get that one straight away, we might be able to get the lead. No, we won't be able to. We're, we do know there's a sneak. All right, there he is. Go and get him. All right, whatever. Good enough. Teammate got him. We're up five to four. We only did 3% with the first push. That's uh, that's not the best thing in the world. You don't really want to see that too much, especially with our comp. Our comp should do a lot of damage. We're just going to super the crow over here. Sword's going to sneak up behind us, but we are going to be able to kill him because we did get our... Well, I guess buff I want to call it. Oh, hopefully it's not a waste. Okay, at least we didn't fully waste the super, but to get him for one shot isn't really that big. You shouldn't be supering for one shot. But I wasn't really too aware that Fox was going to get him. Anyways, Fox did help us get that kill over there. We're just trying to pre-fire. We're going to be able to kill that crow. We're just going to super this guy, because why not? Oh, it's going to be a waste, because you seeing Colt's going to get that kill. Anyways, we're looking good over here. It's 11 to 9, 12 to 9. 13 to 9, 14 9, 15 9, yeah. So as you guys can see, we're, we, we have the domination right now. They are going to get the last siege bot though. So that is huge for us. I think the sneak's going to be there. I don't know. He is invisible right now though, that's for sure. We're going to try and bodyguard Fox. Yeah, we knew he was going to go for Fox since Fox was really low. So we're just going to stand back. We're going to heal up because this is going to be our last push for the entirety of this game. So we definitely want to make it a big one. This crow is trying to ruin our plans. We're not really getting a lot of help on the crow. We're going to be pretty low health going in there. Hopefully Usain can hit that crow. Alright, we, we can't even use our super here. We're just going to go down. Hopefully Fox and the bot are going to be able to take it out. It's looking pretty good. 7%. Alright, so it's up to 7%. Foxtrot or Usain will be able to take that out with each of their supers. So we are looking like we are in a pretty good spot right now. I feel like Sword is definitely invisible. Yeah, there he is. He's going to spin on us. He knows he lost, but, you know, he's just going to give us that friendly spin. But with that being said, that's the end of the game. Uh, that was a pretty decent game to show you guys. I made a few mistakes, a few good plays, and I really love that just average gameplay where you guys can see what to do from the good plays and what not to do from those bad plays. So with that being said, that's the end of the second game. Let's get into the third and final game. And we showed you guys one game where we just lost. We showed you guys, like, a decent win. I wanted to show you guys an absolute domination. So hopefully we can get that with this third and final game. Let's hop right into it. So here we go into the third and final game. And we're actually going to be getting... We're facing a pretty good comp, to be honest. And we're facing another good team. So this is going to be a little tough. But we're just going to run in there. Be tanky. Get that first power up. Or I mean, that first bolt. I really got to get that name down. I don't know why I keep calling it a power up. We got to get our super, basically, when we face this comp. So we're just going to chip away. We are going to be able to get our super. Looks like we're going to be able to kill that dynamite. Just gonna like kind of play ring around the rosy with that Nita. We're not gonna be able to get it, but we are gonna be able to get the gene, which I'm actually pretty surprised that we got that. Gotta kind of stay away from that Nita because he can't outrange us, and we're pretty low. Hope we can get a good pinch in with Fox. Good full clipping by Fox over there. So this is a pretty dominating game so far. We're up five to nothing. We're gonna get that six bull, and we're pretty much dominating. Um, let's see if we can get our super before the siege bot comes. 
There's one hit. Hopefully we can get a second one. Move up a little, Nita. There we go. So we're able to get that super. I'm going to re recharge a little bit. You see Foxtrot going with the sneak. You can see Usain pulling out his super. Hopefully we can get a really good super here and just one push them. All right. Well, I mean, it wasn't a crazy super, but it looks like they've given up already. Well, they pulled our bot, so I guess we're just going to keep shooting. Usain should be able to finish that. That's going to be a crazy quick game. Wow, that's it. That's unreal. So we got that one push. You rarely see that nowadays. But anyways, that's going to be it for the video. I'm sorry I didn't show you guys that extremely epic Frank gameplay. But, you know, I'm not going to spend an hour and a half lying to you guys and showing you an unrealistic footage of, of Frank, which just isn't believable like the other YouTubers do. But, you know, no shots taken to them. But anyways, this is realistically what Frank is. I hope you guys liked the video. Frank can be a little bit more, but, you know... In these games, it wasn't when you're playing top of ladder. It's hard to just dominate like that. So with that being said, that's going to be it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. You guys already know, like, comment, subscribe if you liked it. And if you didn't like it, let me know in the comments what you guys want to see. I read, I'm not kidding you. I read every single comment multiple times, especially if you comment early on. So let me know what you guys want to see and I'll get it out there. I saw a lot about a mortise guide. I'm, I'm working on it. I'm just waiting for some maps to rotate. It's in the process right now. But anyways, thank you guys for watching the video. I hope you guys enjoyed. I will catch you guys tomorrow. Peace.